सो हे गाइज वेलकम बैक टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल एंड दिस इज़ गोइंग टू बी द सिक्स वीडियो इन थर्टी डेज और रियक्ट जावा स्क्रिप्ट सो आवर प्रॉब्लम स्टेटमेंट इज हियर वी हैव टू इम्प्लीमेंट लॉजिक फॉर यू आर एल शॉर्टनर सो बेसिकली आवर एस टी एम एल इज ऑलरेडी डिटेन वी हैव टू इम्प्लीमेंट द लॉजिक सो वेन एवर द यूजर क्लिक ऑन दिस शॉर्ट एंड एंड विल प्रोवाइड अ यू आर एल लिंक दैन वेन एवर द यूजर क्लिक ऑन दिस शॉर्ट एंड बटन सो द लिंक विल भी शॉर्ट एंड सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी हैव टू क्रिएट अ यू स्टेट फॉर डैट we will make original url as a initial variable and set original url as a final variable and initially it is a blank string next we will create another variable or another state you can say which is a shortened url so whenever the url gets shortened we will display our shortened url so set shortened url and it will be a blank string so now value is equals to original url and after on change we will provide a callback function set original url and we will accept a e here which is a synthetic event and we have to write e dot target dot value so that we can get that final state so now we have to create a on click function here which will be a handle click so we have to define our function const handle click is equals to javascript arrow function okay so it is going to be a post request so so you can simply go to bitly api it is a free open source api you can you can read the documentation and you can simply sign up and after you sign up you will you will see uh, here we have a generate access token so this access token you can use in your url shortener so first you have to sign in so let's get back to our code so we will write const response is equals to await axios dot post request so you have to install the axios also i have already installed so you can simply write yarn add axios or npm install axios depends on the package you are using so axios dot post so this will be the final endpoint so await is throwing error because we have to make our function asynchronous so now we will have to pass params and inside params we will pass long underscore url is equals to original url okay and now we have to pass the headers also so headers we will write content type will be application json an authorization will be a api key so this is my api key you can replace your api key by uh, registering on this website you can see bitly and uh, when you sign up you will see a documentation here sort in your first link so you have to create access token for that and you, when you create access token it will ask for your password authentication so when you provide your password and will click on generate token so it will create your api key so by this you can use in your ecosystem so now we will update the final state by set sort and url into response dot data dot id okay and in the catch we will log the error message when the request was unsuccessful so error dot message if i log response data dot id so we have to import the use state also now i think it should work so let's suppose if i copy this link paste it here and sort in 
so you will see our sort and link is here control c and control b you will redirect to a particular website which is this website only so this is something which you can use now you can also show the sort and link here okay so we are basically making null checks like whenever the sort and url is present then only show this html so we will make a div So we have created a div and inside div we have created h4 for the sorting url text and now we have the button and inside button we have the sorting url text so you can see we have this link here same if you like want this one so just control c control v sort in and you can see the sorting url is here and same for the console also so by this logic you can make any custom url sortner so it basically uses a api request for creating or generating any url sortner so if you like this video make sure to subscribe and till then thank you for watching